14 miles. It's getting pretty close now. 343, 4485. Let's missile launch from them. So we're going to fire at those guys. And we're going to go defensive. Hello again, minions. It's Wheezy. Today we're back in DCS. I'm going through the F-15C Flaming Cliffs 3 campaign missions. I uh, figured I'd bring you along for this one. This one is a seed strike, suppression of enemy air defenses. So essentially what we're doing uh, as a flight of F-15s is clearing out the airspace so some F-16s can come in and destroy some Russian anti-air. There's a little bit of a military story here about G Georgia and Russia, but whatever. I get to fly in an airplane and try and blow shit up. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna, <laughs> we're gonna do that. Uh, as we're loading in here, you're gonna notice that things may look a little different from my last DCS video. So as we're getting settled here in the cockpit, and we're gonna fire up. Chevy three Electronics. One. Bra, three one Talk to air traffic. Request F startup. 18, Chevy three one. Request startup. And the radio is going to talk to us about the contacts nearby. Uh, you may Chevy notice that this one. looks a little nicer here. Three one one. As we're just talking over each other. Great, thank you. So we'll go ahead and fire up our engines here. Chevy three one. Magic one one. Bra. And we've got uh, quite a better looking cockpit here. Looking all nice and fancy. And if we jump out here, you may notice that uh, our aircraft also looking quite a bit nicer than previously. I uh, got a new graphics card, honestly primarily for DCS, just I wanted the better, better graphics quality. So, to repeat, DCS, the core game, the Su-25T, and I think the PF-51, World War II aircraft, are completely free. The core game, this map, uh, and a couple of aircraft are free. The Flaming Cliffs 3-pack, which I bought that as the F-15C, A-10A, Su-33, Su-30-27, it's got a bunch of aircraft in it. Um, it's actually quite... Affordable. It's like I think forty bucks when it's full price for the entire thing. Um, so that's what the F-15C is from. Fundamentally, this is a free game, and I have spent more money <laughs> related to this game for flight sticks, rudder pedals, the track IR, a new video card. Most expensive goddamn free game I've ever played. But if you're in to simulation games, I love driving sims, and now I really love flight sims, and, and you got the money, I mean, it's worth it. So, anyway, I'll stop talking here. Let's request taxi now that they're... Chevy uh, 3 one. Magic one Chevy three one. Now that engine's just spun up here. At and we'll three one. Taxi. taxi to runway 13. We're right here, so it should be right here, yeah. The runway right here by us, so. Don't get ahead of me! <laughs> you little son of a bitch. F 15 trying to jump out ahead of me. I'm still getting used to these rudder pedals. I've had to tweak them, and they're. Whoa! They're. a little. a little touchy. I, I still struggle with them a little bit. Close the cockpit. Flaps down. Two. Spike. Three o'clock. All right. Here we go. Chevy three one.
climb and turn towards our objective. Magic one one, bra three 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 four one hundred and forty at two zero. course now we're about 20,000 feet eight miles from our point here we'll stop burning so hard let's see if we've got anything here so we've got our objectives over here that the F-16s are going to be taken out uh, a couple of MiG-29s in the area so we're going to basically go in the area see if those MiG-29s are going to come and engage and if so we'll uh, deal with them and then call in the F-16s for their strike So we got a MiG-29 there on the RWR at 1 o'clock. So we're going to listen to the AWACS for callouts. See if these guys are going to get aggressive. And if so, then uh, we'll have to engage them. So we can see we got uh, the F-16s coming up behind us on the RWR. So there's the flight of F-16s. So basically we're gonna be rallying around, there's that, what's that for me? Yeah, for me it's waypoint five-ish. So actually I'll go ahead and, I think I'm navigating to waypoint four, yeah. Navigating to waypoint four right now. Then I'll turn up to waypoint five, see if that, those MiG-29, whoop. <laughs> see if those MiG-29s come in. Uh, if so, I'll clear them out and then call in that F-16 strike. Alright, so bra, 315, 50 miles, 18,000 hot, so they're coming towards me, I've got some contacts, bearing range, altitude, um, so they're basically calling out and telling me if those guys are in front of me. Contact bearing, checking 2, 6, 14, 9, 0, bra, 313, 450, at 18,000 I'm miss that waypoint, I'm going to go ahead and skip over to waypoint 5 here. Contact bearing, 3, 1, 3, 4, 4, 5, and switch our radar on. So spike means they're showing those, getting radar from those MIGs. Looks like they probably are going to be engaging. So let's turn towards them. I'm going to go and switch over to track while scan. A single target track. Is this two guys or one? Let's see. One. Chevy three one. Magic one one. Bra right, three one. Both of them locked up. Forty at eighteen thousand hot. All right, so they're forty miles out, which is getting close. So we may be engaging here. They're hot, so they're flying in. One. Magic so one in. one. Bra three two six. Point three thousand eighty at twenty three thousand. So what we're going to do is we're going to accelerate, increase our probability of killing our missile if we have to fire. I will climb a little bit more, try to get 25,000. So basically, if they start locking me up, then I'm going to shoot them the fuck down. <laughs> and then go defensive and try not to die. We've got two locked right now. 25 miles. Two, one spike, one o'clock. Colt one, on station at Bulls one four six for right, twenty five. So we've got fourteen thousand. Missiles are in range now. I'm not being locked yet. 
Alright, so F-16s are on station, standing by. close now. Still, I'm still above 15,000, so those SA-19s shouldn't be able to get me. We're going to turn, head south a little bit, climb. Ooh, that was intense! Hey, that's the first time I think I've survived a merge. <laughs> Alright, let's climb. How are my boys doing? Don't have any other contacts so far on the radar, so I splashed one with a... Fox 3, M120, and one with a Fox 2, an AIM-9. And let's go ahead and call in this strike here. Colt 1-1, one, one, push. Colt 1, pushing from waypoint 2 at 15,000. Oh, we've used... Oh, I've been burning 3. this whole time. I've used a lot of fuel. Pull that throttle. I got, I got all worked up from getting into that merge. Looks like the strike is good. So we got radar contacts that are hot, so they're heading this way. Let's see if they actually... This guy is 
not. This guy's actually flanking. But again, they're still they're still well north into kind of Russian airspace, not messing with where we are. Hey, in the so we're not gonna run in there and chase them. Air refueling and AWACS. All right, enemy site was three. destroyed. RTB, our engaged target is about to kill you. So I think what we're going to do before we go back to land, I, is because I haven't really done this before, is I think we're going to go and try a mid-air refuel just to see if we can get some practice. So uh, let's head down towards Texaco. So we're actually heading in that way. Let's see, can I pick them up on a radar? I think they're further out than that. Or is that them? Twenty no, twenty thousand feet. That's that's Texaco, so that's That's our air refueling right there. So we'll kind of plot an intercept here. So left control and R is gonna be our refueling panel thing, receptacle. So we've got the F-15 flying cap underneath them and the AWACS juddering its way across the sky there as it's kind of out of render distance. Tell them they're going to come on refuel. Chevy, three, one, request rejoin. Chevy 3-1, Texaco 1-1, one, one. proceed to pre-contact at 20,000, at 350. So that's 350 knots, which is going to be true airspeed, I believe, not indicated airspeed, so it'll probably be a little bit less than what's indicated up here on our HUD. Trying to find the exact right throttle is so tough. Alright, getting a little jittery here. And 46 minutes later. Contact. You're taking fuel. Oh god. <laughs> like all over the place here. We, we did it a little bit. <laughs> we're gonna call that good for today. So we're we're gonna drop down and away here. And uh, 
we got a we got a couple of got a couple of glugs. We're good. <laughs> We're good. All right, let's head. Uh, let's go ahead and head back. Flaps down. Gear down. Altitude down. This is not a textbook approach here. Chevy three one magic one one bra three two two four one hundred twenty at twenty five thousand cold. Bingo fuel. Bingo fuel. Oh man, these guys are lined right up. right in front of my buddy here probably god I feel drunk when I'm landing with these rudders oh god oh god Oh god. <laughs> Oops. Yeah, these rudders are so touchy. Like I can't... Like they're either too touchy or not touchy enough. I need to figure out the curves for them a little bit better. Cause... Ugh. Ugh. That was not great. <laughs> successfully survived my first ever merge minions i'm impressed with me <laughs> hopefully you guys enjoyed that if you haven't seen some of my other dcs videos go check those out although now they're gonna be a lot prettier obviously with my new graphics card but hey buddy you're probably doing a better job than me huh? do i still have my air breakup so yeah go check out those other dcs videos uh if you want to otherwise See you guys in the next one.